YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy DB Kicks, and we are back with another video, man. And today, I have a new challenge that I want to throw out there to the internet. You know what I'm saying? So, before we get into that, if you are new to the channel, welcome. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, man. Hit that notification bell so you know when your boy's dropping some heat. And today, we're going to do something a little bit different. You know, kind of have some fun, you know what I'm saying, with, with the sneakers. No new pickups at the moment. They're on the way, but I wanted to do something different. I've been thinking about this one for a few days now, but I'm finally able to get it out to you guys. So before we even get started, anybody that wants to accept the challenge and wants to show me what you guys got, then hey, by all means, that's cool. So Bobby sneaker world off top, shoes up, sleeves down, uh, K Fresh, anybody that wants to get in on this, I don't care who does it, but it's gonna be interesting. So let's go ahead and get into it. The stranger. <laughs> not the stranger the strangest <laughs> sneaker in your collection it can be more than one something you feel that's very unique but this right here is by far the strangest the weirdest shoe i've probably ever purchased i i don't know why i bought it to be honest with you but and here it is the <laughs> what the hell the adidas first of all i wonder do anybody know like who this is even though y'all can just fast forward but the adidas jeremy scott flower bear now let, let me explain <laughs> let me explain jeremy scott sneakers were a thing at one point like these were huge all right um i lived in jacksonville so at the time you had to go to orlando mall and the orlando mall had the adidas store and that's where we had to get them from but they have like this one they had the gorilla that had like t-shirt on they had the, the pink, pink the pink teddy bear the, the pink teddy bear is actually kind of fire um the leopard with the tail on the back i had that one but i ended up selling it and then you had this one this is probably one of the craziest ones they got ones with wings coming off the sides uh, i don't even know like i wore this shoe to tallahassee homecoming back in like 2012 or something like that and surprisingly i got a ton of compliments on this shoe like people was like bro those are fire where'd you get those at those are crazy and then the outfit i have with it like i'll throw it up on the screen somewhere the outfit was just ridiculous like i don't ever want to dress like that again but i got when i got this shoe i wore it that one night and i said i'm never wearing this shoe again and i, I haven't i did wear it but i have not rocked it since um but and the other crazy thing is this shoe these retail for like $200 to like $250, I think. These were very expensive at the time. The box was like this big because he got this big teddy bear. It's the tongue right here. And um, I don't know, man. It's just it's just a wild shoe. And it's kind of like, I don't know. Like, I can't sell it. I can't flip it. I can't make anything off of it. I'm never going to wear it. It really just, it doesn't even sit in back here. It sits in a closet. But one day I'm actually gonna put them in a, um, a container or something. Just, you know, people that ever do come in here, like this is something you can show them. Be like, what the hell is like, what's going on? It feels just like a teddy bear and the tongue is a teddy bear. I don't even know if this will fit in here. Like, let's see, will it fit? I still got the tags on it, yo. Look, <laughs> why, was I, why was I wearing the tags on my shoes still, man? That's, uh, I was legit. <laughs> it fits but you kind of gotta like snap yeah it's it barely even fits in a container yo like and then you can see bro's arms hanging out man look at this oh his neck fix his neck <laughs> look at that man the flower bears yo like so man, anything anything else wild about this shoe like it's not that it's not uncomfortable it was pretty comfortable it's just it's just ridiculous and i just don't know why i would who who owned a pair of jeremy scott so comment down below let me know have you ever owned a pair of these jeremy scott adidas who remembers this era like this was these were a big thing yo like i think probably the only pair that i've seen recently people wear i've seen the all denim pair with the wings coming off of it those are kind of fire but this is nowhere near my style anymore and it never will be again i feel like a, a little girl or something should have business wearing this i don't know why i did so forgive me y'all forgive 
Oh, the sneaker guys, forgive me, man. This is probably why I take L's on sneakers out, because they was like, nah, bro, you used to wear stuff like this, man. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you, man? But it was just a statement piece. It was like, you know, being a, a, in Tallahassee at the time, like you wanted the, the, the virus outfit. I don't even know if that's a word. You wanted to be flashy, like you just had to have it. And I did it, yo, and <laughs> I don't I do these even match? Like are they I think the print's even different on each shoe. It is. So yeah, by far, um, this is the weirdest shoe. Adidas, Jeremy Scott, Flower Bear. I couldn't even tell you if they have these on stock X or something like that. I mean I can look right now. Some of the wings. The last pair of the teddy bears sold on March 20th for 340. Mm. Wow. That so was they unexpected. Yeah, so they some of the pairs do. Oh, and they had the camouflage bear too. <laughs> yeah, I don't I, I can't find them on I can't find them on StockX. I remember they did have one that came out that actually sparked a lot of controversy because it had shackles on the ankle. And um they I don't think they ever released. It is what it is. It was a good moment. I'll probably, you know, if somebody wanted to buy it, like by all means, but I probably won't ever really sell it. I just, there's no way I, I can get rid of it. I don't even have the box anymore. But with that being said, man, comment down below. What's like the strangest sneaker you ever purchased? The strangest sneaker that you have? And if anybody wants to get in on this challenge and drop a video, show me your strangest, most weird, wild shoe ever that you own. I don't think anybody could top this though. This is, this is the weirdest of the weird, yo. <laughs> Like, seriously, this is crazy weird, so. He's gonna think that's a toy. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, greatly appreciate it, man. We working grinding every single day. Me and my boy Teddy finna get up out of here. You know what I'm saying? And you know what? It's four, today's 420 and then like the hippie theme on this. I didn't plan this, I swear to God I didn't plan this. But again, we are out of here.